This is the feeling of the face of a man with fulfillment. A man with the will to make his community a better place to live. His name is Adewale Oyewo. He is the chairman of the Central Working Committee of all the community development associations in White Sand area under the Gondo Ikotun Local Council Development Area. This was the condition of most roads in this neighborhood when the chairman of the CDA was elected a few years ago. Although White Sand is geographically located in Igodo Ikotsun, it is famous among residents of Oshodi, Solo and Alimosho areas because of its dense population. The population continue to put pressure on its poor facilities. Vibu CDA is more than a decade old with million residents of different tribes from Nigeria and West Africa. How did Vibu CDA in this challenging environment make its way to the top as the second best in Lagos State? What they did do to win the award? Majority of uh, inhabitants here, we are taxpayers. And the best part of the, all this, we were the one that bought transformer for the community. We bought uh, poles, 175 poles. And uh, initially, there was no road at all. We were passing Kudegu Ijegu, Kudegu Ijegu before we can get to this village. Annually, when we constructed the road, we, we used almost uh, 10 million on monthly basis, on yearly basis. 10 million era to maintain that road. And people are tired. All this money we are contributing is through communal effort. And we have some uh, donors among us. We have some uh, philanthropists. They give us money. And we levy ourselves. We levy ourselves. The graded road has become the joy of the neighborhood today. But the residents have not forgotten the pains and pangs of what life meant when their road was rough. I be the security for community the first time when they start to do road. I be the way I collect money for for them. That time safe people not too plenty like that. So you understand ba? And at that time, both people, both Wakada people, both Morua people, both Moto people, everybody is suffering. But the now community are coming where they are, do their best about the road. Now now we see where we go take the pass, we go take to do some things, and the marketer they are full inside the area now. Community have tried so much by we. If you see this road, this light now, we did it ourselves. We did high tension from here to Isheri, communal effort. We have about four or five transformers here now on our own. We bought all of them, and there are other other uh, good developments that we have done here on ourselves. No health care here. If any child is sick at night, if the parent has no car. Before you take them to Ijegu or Isheri to revive the child, we will lose the child. No police station. There was a, night, a time here was like a terror zone. Robbers were coming from outside to come and terrorize us here. You understand? No police station. Here was a very terrible situation. Then the CDS, with the help of the CDS, we had to organize security outfits on our own. We had to, even at a point, everybody, we became security men ourselves. Nobody sleeps. The most significant incident that led to the determination of the CDA to take full responsibility of this project was the gory experience of the elderly people in the community.
o ti e a wahala na ti e po gan o sugbon a community won try yi won gbiyan ju is a very tug of war is more than anything people like all these other kind of people will be falling victim accident there and there fractures as this weak leg we can revive about seven people for fracture the record is there attention not to take the car. so i didn't believe you will come during the reading season you could have know what we are suffering for it's too much the success and recognition that the CDA got from spending millions of naira to grade and maintain the 1.6 km road that has opened up the community is driving them to him higher. BGC, Victoria Island and some places like that that are enviable today, people made it so. And that is why we, we, we've been able to uh, gather ourselves together, talk to ourselves, motivate ourselves that this we this this is our own vgc uh, so when it comes to uh, donating money when it comes to contribution when it comes to uh, sometimes going all the way to to uh, physically do these things on our own uh, so the motivation has been that this is our own place that we have settled Oyewo and his community reformers are confident that their project will gain the support of the government and donor agencies. They believe it keys into Governor Akimu Miyambode's engagement and empowerment of community development associations. So, Viable CDA wants to do more. To achieve this quantum leap, it is calling on men of good fortune and corporate organizations to support its next projects. A community newspaper to spread the information and a link bridge that will connect them with other communities in Festag and Amuwad of in areas of Lagos State. If you could get those philanthropists who can uh, assist us to build the road and got us, we'll be very appreciative. We'll be very appreciative. Community members are tired of contribution. They are tired. So we want government to come and help us. We want government. No. No one naira that is invested in this place that will be regretted. If any person or group of persons want to partner with us, in fact, the road is very clear. This is a very, very vibrant area that if you put in your one naira, you will not regret it. Like myself, I have packaged some few graduates in my house who want to start writing a, a newspaper called White Sand Magazine. We'll be producing it. So, so pe many people with so many ideas are coming up. Joba, if you allow me, be one. Allow me to be my baba. I'm a mag boy. I'm a soki. I'm a run. Allow me. Conjo, conchano. I'm a run. Allow me. Lori, I'm a run. Allow me. Fibi, I want.